Hey what's up I'm Nizio Cole and welcome back to another Watch Dogs mod showcase. Today we're going to be looking at the slow-mo mod for Watch Dogs 2. This is a mod that basically adds the focus ability from the first game into the second game. This is something that I've wanted in Watch Dogs 2 for a very long time because being able to just have more time to think about an action before you do it is very helpful and it's also really cool just seeing everything play out in slow motion. Basically how it works is you press your hacking button, which on controller is LB, and it'll slow down time. The only thing it doesn't have is that screen effect that you see in Watch Dogs 1 where it kind of makes everything look a little different when you're in slow motion, but I think you could probably achieve that same look by having a reshade filter and binding it to the same key that activates the slow-mo. But yeah, so it works in all of the different modes that you can be in. It works on foot, it works in a car, it works while you're hacking from a drone or an RC car, and also works in cameras. The only thing that doesn't really work is the audio isn't slowed down. Some of the animations are slowed down when they really shouldn't be. And also you can tell how low frame rate some of these animations really are, like the wheels spinning on cars, because it is very obvious once you slow it down a little bit. One more thing, this mod is part of a mod pack on Nexus Mods. This is the only link to it that I could find that wasn't in a Discord server. So there will be a few more mods when you download this mod. In case you're wondering, the extra mods are the Immersive Gameplay Overhaul, Watch Dogs 1 Camera Mod, Edited Escape Key Button, Black Net Hack Mod, Less Intrusive GPS Markers, Reversed HUD, Removed Hacking Reticles, and Better Nights and Blackouts. So as always, I'll have this mod linked in the description along with a tutorial on how to install mods. And if you wanna try that reshade hack I was talking about, I'll have a link on how to install reshade as well. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.